What is going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. Pokemon continues to pump out new products for their Pokemon Go TCG set, the most recent of which are these Pokemon Go gift tins featuring Blissey, a Pikachu, and a Snorlax. All of them contain a little special card inside of it that is the regular card from the set with a new hollow foil pattern. So that is what we will be taking a look at in today's video. So we are going to be looking at three of these tins, one of each. You've got your Blissey, you've got Pikachu, and you've got Snorlax. We are going to get in to this Pikachu one first. And real quick, we are going to take a deep dive into this one just to kind of see what all is included in it. I know we've got some packs, we've got some promos, and then the other ones we're just going to open and kind of just show off the cards inside there. I'm not going to waste your time going through each one of them separately. We're just going to get into this Pikachu one first. Open her up right here on the back side. And you can see right here, if you just pause the video real quick, you can read all of this that is on the back here. Pikachu has a gift for you. And that is these tins. These tins are in fact the gift. So inside of this tin, we go ahead, we'll just pop the top on in here. This is of course, obviously the Pikachu one. So this is the common Pikachu from the set. And then if we pop this thing out here, Underneath of this is actually another promo card, or should have been. Where did it go? Oh, okay. Um, I thought it was underneath of this one, so when you pulled it apart, but that's whatever. Anyway, it is in there, at least, so that's nice. Um, I don't know what happened there, unless I'm just wrong on where it was supposed to be positioned, but... Here is the special delivery Pikachu right here. I mean, obviously not really special delivery. It's not written up here at the top like that Charizard card that we're supposed to be getting. Here is that promo card. Every one of these tins will have that inside of it. Then you have the regular set Pikachu with that Cosmo hollow foil pattern there off to the side. Then you've got your code card for that tin right there going out. And then we do have our four Pokemon Go packs right here. We'll keep these off to the side. We're going to see which one of these tins actually gives us the better pools. So we've got our Pikachu opened. Uh, here's our sticker sheet featuring the uh, three Pokemon from the tins right there. And then here are, oh, okay. Here are some Pokemon Go codes if you want to pause the video and snatch them up. Okay, so I was wrong on that Pikachu card position because they were like that in both of those other tins that I opened, which here's everything for that. Pause the screen, take these codes, and get some good pulls and some good stuff in Pokemon Go. Now all that's out of the way, let's get into our packs with our first tin here. We will open up Pikachu. Also, all of the sticker sheets are all of the same inside of each one of those tins. They were all the three Blissey, Snorlax, and Pikachu stickers that we saw in that um, very first tin with Pikachu there. There we go, there's a code card going out for you all. We've got a wonderful a Magikarp, a Meltan, the Eevee, the Pikachu, which is the other version of that. So that's kind of cool they did that. But I'm, I'm, cu I'm curious why they didn't use the actual rare version of Pikachu from the set like they did Snorlax and Blissey, but they use the common one. I don't know if it's maybe because it looks a little bit more Pokemon Go-ish since he's walking next to a human person, but either way, they they didn't, and I, that's their decision, so whatever. It's odd. There's a Camerupt followed by... <laughs> oh, you can't get any more poetic than that. I think the only thing that would have made that better was if Blissey had been in that pack. Maybe as like the reverse hollow or something, or Snorlax the reverse. Either way, if all three of them had been in that pack, that would have been pretty cool. Would have been pretty, pretty cool. We got Charmander. We got Apom. We got Bulba and a Numel. And a Raticate, a Lolan Raticate, I should say. Meltan and a Conkledor. Con Conkeldor? Conkledor? Conkeldor. 
Con Conkelder, whatever it is. We got the ultra rare there, and there is your code card going out. Use it, get some good pulls. Please don't worry, I will sleeve up all of the ultra rares and above um, during, you know, when we switch between the tins here. I'm not gonna waste your time by doing it in the middle of opening. Uh, I take too long to do it, so uh, I just, you know, I just wait. We got Pidove, we got that rare candy. And a Gyarados Hollow, very nice. Psychic Energy, that is my energy for sure. Pokemon Go card for you. Go, get your pools, get your stuff. Let's get into this last pack from the Pikachu tin. And please let me know down there in that comment section after you destroy the like button and hit the subscribe and, and the notification bell. Let me know down there, have you seen any of these tins in your local stores. Now, I'll put a picture up here on the screen of my local Walmart and their store display. Um, I know Real Breaking Nate also did a video on it. Um, that display is actually what I saw in uh, my, my Walmart and actually went and I got some of these. So there was a ton of them. Is that a, is that a ditto? It is. All right, I unfortunately am not gonna peel this one. I still need the Bidoof as a unpeeled ditto, and I also need that spin rack, which I'm looking for as well. And then we, <laughs> let's go. We got that Blissey back there as well. So there we are, and there is that code card for you. Let's get these things in a sleeve and move on to, uh, well, we just pulled the Blissey, so why don't we go to Blissey next? Got those sleeved up like I promised you I would. And we will move right on in to the Blissey packs here. Toss that off to the side. We don't need it not to. How do you do? Shout out to Leon Hart there. He doesn't even know who I am, but I'm shouting him out. <laughs> Onyx, okay, and a Charmander. We got that Meltan followed by an evolved form into Melmetal. Right there, Electric Energy, Chansey, Lunatone, Slowbro, Code Card. Moving right along into our second Blissey pack here with the Alolan Raticate setting right there on the front. Let's switch it up, do a card trick. There's a code card for you. One, two, three, four, that V-Star marker again. And I am always right about those. Rare Candy, War Turtle, Pokestop. Alolan Raticate, Larvitar. Alolan Ratatatatatata. A spin, oh man, it is not the ditto. Spinarak, Pikachu, okay, Lapras. Now give us a Snorlax. No, Glycopod Hollow. All right, very cool. Let's go on and get into our next pack for Blissey. Oof, let's go. Tear these things open. We got Rattata, Alolan, Numel. A Raticate, Tranquil. No, I'm not gonna do it. Larvitar, Melmetal, Reverse, and a Charizard Hollow. Let's go. If you ever, you ever think like pulling a holographic Charizard used to be like a huge deal, and now you just kind of pull it and it's like, okay, yeah, that's like my 100th holographic Charizard. I mean, I guess it was the same for like Vivid Voltage too, but like it's just so weird how times have changed to where like the hollows just really don't mean anything anymore. We need to get back to where like the hollows are the special cards again. That, that was a good day. I mean, alternate arts are great. So really, I don't know if I actually wanna switch because alternate arts are fantastic. Tranquil, Charmander, Eevee, Natsu, Ambipom, let's go Chansey, this is your last. Oh, uh, there it is. Give me that Radiant P toys. I like it. Don't worry about me. I'm just Blast toys. And then we follow that up with an Articuno. Very nice. So pretty good there. I do like the I do like the Radiant tr Kanto Trio in this set. Venusaur is my favorite. I think they did a very lazy job with Blast toys and Charizard and Venusaur, honestly. But Venusaur is my favorite of the three. Um, Blastoise just looks like he's standing in pee. It's just, there's no getting around. All right, Snorlax, it is your time to shine with your four packs. 
Can you beat a Radiant Blastoise, a Bidoof Peelable Ditto, and a Conkled, Con Conkledur, Conkle, now I'm self-conscious about how I say it. Conkelder V. <laughs> All right, can, can you do it? Can you do it? Um, why not? Let's just let's just go pack tricks on all all of Snorlax's packs. The last four. Who cares? Let's do this thing. Lightning Energy, Lunatone, Slowbro, Zatu, and Magikarp. Pidove. Come on, Onyx. Eevee, Charmander, Slowbro into a oh a Hollow Lapras right there. Code card upside down for you. Pause the video, flip your computer or your phone around, and uh, grab that code. Hopefully you got it, because it's gone now. It's gone. Just like uh, just like my money on these tins, because just, you know, haven't pulled much of anything. There's a couple cards I still do need from, from the set. Um, none of these that I have pulled are it. Uh, I, okay, okay, the Bidoof, peelable Bidoof, yeah. I guess I did need that. Um, but most of the ones that I need that are left, come on, yes! Also needed this Spinarak peelable ditto right here. So forgive me for being so excited about a um, ditto, but I did actually need it. So I'm very, very happy to get it because they're like $8 right now for a peelable card, which is absolutely insane. And then we've got a hollow Venusaur right behind it. So that's, that's pretty nice. I'll take that. I'll take that. There's another code card for you there. Put Spinarak up here. He will not be peeled. So now I have the complete set, the Numel, the Spinarak, and the Bidoof unpeeled. Um, so I'll peel another one if I, if I get another Ditto. Yeah, sure, I'll peel it. Let's just get into this pack and see what all we can get. Go ahead, there you go. Somehow you can read that, I don't know. One, two, three, four. Let's go. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I was gonna ask a question and I just changed my mind. Anyway, how do you feel about the peelable dittos in this set? Like, I understand, you know, it's just like a little gimmick, but I, I think it's pretty cool. You know, cause in, in Pokemon Go, you catch one and it's like, oh, it's actually a ditto. And then here, you know, you, you get a card and you're like, oh cool, it's a Spinarak, but actually no, it's a Ditto. I don't know, I'm easily amused. So there's Blastoise. Okay, so we've got the Charizard, the Venusaur, and the Blastoise. So we, 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 we've got to pull, I mean, there's got to be something in this pack, right? There's got to be something, but let's be realistic. These are Pokemon TCG tins. I'm the one opening them and my luck with the tin is really bad. So um, I'm actually not surprised if I don't pull anything. Right over there, one, two, three, four. I don't know why I have to count every single time. Psychic energy, okay. This might be a good sign, maybe. War turtle, egg incubator, camerupt, numel, bulbasaur, onyx, by barrel, a slow poke, a reverse hollow Zapdos, followed by, come on, give me something, anything, please. Let's go, Melmetal Hollow. That is not good. Just like that, I prove once again why my luck with Pokemon TCG tins is so bad, yet I will never learn my lesson about buying them and trying to open them and get good cards from them. Because from Snorlax, I got the peelable Spinarak, which to be fair, I did need for the collection. Blissey, Radiant Blastoise, standing in a pool of urine, which is gross, but that's what it is. Pikachu tin, we got the Conkeldor V and the Bidoof peelable Ditto, which I did need the spin rack and the Bidoof. Um, so I got two cards that I needed out of these tens. But honestly, like from these three, let me know in the comments section, which one you think won this battle of the Pokemon Go um, special delivery, special gift 
tens. And that is gonna do it for this video, everyone. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me while I opened some Pokemon cards. Hopefully you enjoyed your time, and if you did, demolish that like button on this video, hit that subscribe button, check that notification bell, and until next time, stay awesome and keep pulling fire.